and welcome to my home. My name is Jackie, and I went to Portland Leather Goods. They have a new location in Austin. I work in Austin. I don't live in Austin. So we took a trip. This is the second. I went on the second opening weekend. So this is June 22nd. You're not going to see this until July, maybe later. Depends on how the videos come out. But that doesn't change the items I purchased. This is the taco pouch. Now, I had gotten up a taco pouch from Melissa's Corner. I gave that one to my twin. She loved it. And when I went to the store and saw this sparkly pearl, I just about died. So this pearl is a unicorn color. And that's if you're new to PLG, this is a unicorn color, which means this is limited production, uh, smaller less of them well actually this one might not be a unicorn it could be a unicorn i can't remember but it's pearl it's beautiful a pearl taco don't quote me on the unicorn because that unicorn tag actually went with this pouch now this is called the eclipse pouch and this is the makeup pouch and this was the unicorn now this unicorn pouch retails for 56 dollars and so it says, what is a unicorn? Unicorns are a limited edition pieces made in small batches from leather hides and unique colors and characteristics are a rare breed. So this is a limited run bag. This ellipse, ellipse couch pouch was $56. I paid full price. This is not a second or a, you know, it, I guess it's considered their perfect, you know, regular line. And I, on it, I put on a charm. This is my own charm. And this is a PLG charm that was given to me for going to the store. Um, it was a just gift with purchase. If you wanted one, you could have one. They, I asked for two. They let me have two. Um, and it might be just because it's a brand new store location. I don't know if it's something they do with all the Portland other goods. But I asked. They're like, hey, how much is a store? And they said, oh, you can have it for free. I'm like, what? Are you sure? Can I have two? And she's like, yeah, sure. I'm like, thank you. So what's in this cosmetic pouch? This is now going to be my new pouch going from bag to bag to bag. As long as this pouch fits in my bag, this is how I'm going to change out bag. So what's in here? Everything. I have my wallet. I have my sunglasses. I have perfume. I have lipstick. I have ear pods. Um, here's my current new lipstick. It's a Chanel lipstick, which I love. This is my other lipstick. This is a L'Oreal, which I also love. Um, so I love all types of lipsticks and i love all types of cosmetics well lipsticks mostly and perfume this is going to be um dolce Ma dolce and gabbana the one it's a men's cologne or men's fragrance or whatever you want to term it so i bought this item and i bought this item no i'm not done i did not buy a bag i have so many bags and i had gifted all of my totes to my sister and i'm very very picky about totes or purses or bags one of the things about portland leather goods i don't enjoy is that they don't do any type of edge coat which is great for the slgs i'm fine with the slgs i don't actually want an edge coat on slgs but i do like stitched edge now this has a stitched edge because there's a zipper but totes that are open totes without a stitched, without a, a zipper will not have a stitched edge. I want that stitched edge or a rolled edge or somehow covered edge. So those are just those minor things that I care about. The other thing I purchased was this. So this is a heart bob thing, a heart purse charm. And then I added um, an, my other free star i got so why did i buy this i bought this completely and only for one purpose um my car fob so my car fob is the type that you do not actually need it to start the car and i just need to, and i don't even have to use it to open the car i can touch the car just by having it so i don't really need to have access to it i just need to have it on me so on there is also my you know apple um Thing. So in case I lose my keys, I can find my keys. So these are the three things I purchased. And this is still not an inexpensive if trip, guys. So even though, um, so this was like 56, this was 20, and this was 20. So with taxes and everything, it was over $100. Uh, there were some fees involved in there, but I'm very impressed. It, the store is, oh, I also bought this. I bought this. I forgot how much this cost. This is a luggage tag, maybe $13 or something like that. It's also in that pearl color. So right there, it's $100. So plus tax, I guess it was maybe $120. Um, 
so it has a compass rose stamped on it and it's a, a luggage tag that just has portland leather you can put your address on here name email phone and you could um it doesn't actually open it doesn't it's not one of those open it's just a covered i just really love the color so i, I knew i was gonna buy this I, I picked up all the other little leather goods i'm like okay i like all the little leather goods and I like luggage tags. I like compass roses because I'm a geography major. And I just think it's gorgeous. Oh, what's in my taco pouch, you might ask? Well, lipstick. It's all lipstick. So I have a bunch of lipstick. I have Hermes lipstick in here. I have Estee Lauder lipstick in here. I have uh, my Hermes smalls, Hermes large. And I have this Dior lip glow. The Dior lip glow is my least favorite out of them all. Um, the texture of the lip glow is not for me. But I have it, so I wear it. This is um, color Capucine a couple summers ago. Two summers ago, I think it was it color or the color or whatever color. And those are refillable. So someday when I finish that lipstick, I will actually be able to put on put in a new refill. So that's what I have. I have my lipstick pouch. I have my Ellipse Cosmetic pouch in a gray color. I have this, I think they call this teal. And then I have this in pearl. So that's what I bought my PLG experience. It was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. If you're in Austin, it's not the easiest location to find. It is in downtown Austin. It is literally in downtown Austin. You, But that's where people go when you go to Austin. Austin's not huge. Austin just has a lot of stuff around Austin. So Austin itself, pretty cool i also walked we were going to stop by the hermes store in austin i drove by it zero parking so if anybody knows anything about austin the hermes store is on south congress south congress is the street in austin it is the street that goes all the way up to the capitol everybody drives on it all the things are there all the stores are there all the fun food places are there everything's off congress it is the place to be which means no parking. So we walked, we drove by. My husband was not in a mood. And I would have just bought more lipstick anyway. And James is like, Do you really want more lipstick? Like, yes, I always want more lipstick. He goes, Gia, yeah, do we do it? But honey, I can see you're done. Let's go. Let's go. It's fine. So we drove up there. I saw the store. I took a photo of the location. So my first Hermes trip might be coming up someday soon. Um, will I buy a bag? Oh, will I buy lipstick? Yes. Will I probably buy perfume? Maybe. Um, and I also want to look at their homewares because I actually love teacups a lot. Um, now, I'm not sure I'm paying Hermes prices for teacups, but I will pay Hermes prices for lipstick. Somehow I justify the lipstick more than the teacup, mainly because I have like a thousand teacups. So anyway, thank you so much for watching my video. Do you like Portland leather goods? I'm not a huge fan of their totes, but I do love their small leather goods, and I will be buying some more eventually. Um, this is going to last a long time. I really don't need to buy any more, but if this works out for me, I will probably buy another color. Because if they had had this in this size in blue, it would have come home. So anyway, thank you so much for having a great um, for watching my video, and have a great day. Bye.